welcome to Jackie Thornton's Creative Lifestyle. Thank you for joining me today. Today I'm going to be um, making a card that um, is for the instructions on how to make one of the cards in the kit that um, a lot of you have purchased for the month of, month of April. And um, so this is the instructions on how to put that together. And then I have two other videos that will be coming out um, today as well. And that is for the other two cards that you can make from the kit. You can also make many other kits, many other cards. There's lots of product in the kit. So um, it will enable you to do scrapbook pages and kits. So this is just um, some ideas from where, from me to you, to how you can take your kit and move it into different directions and make different things. So the first card today will be Happy Mother's Day, and um, we're going to put this card together. So what I've done is I've started off with what we need. So the measurements of our card, once we have it, is 21 by 15, and then scored at 10.5. Then you will need a piece of card. Now this particular card is 9.5 by 13.5, and, and this one here is 8 centimetres by 12.5. And, and that is the oh so succulent patterned paper. So you can decide which side you want to have that on. Okay, so let's get started. So to put the card together, what we first of all need to do is to make these into, whoops, to make them into flags. So you will get your scissors. There we go. Now all I do is I eyeball up the middle. So I look across here and I go, well, that's about the middle. I want the flag to come up about, probably about that high, which is about just over an inch up to there. Then I take it from this corner to where I just cut and do the same on the other side to the point of the cut. And that will give you a nice square flag. Now the second one you do exactly the same. You go up on the middle, so you're eyeballing it. Take the corner across to the cut and the corner across to where the cut finishes. All right, and if you just don't quite go through, just clip that off. Okay, stick that, centering it on the top and placing it down. Now, I'm going to just do something a little bit different to what I did before. Now, before I did, oops, I put the ribbon across the actual DSB. I'm going to do on this one, I'm going to do it across both of them. And the reason I'm doing that this time, whoops, is because I just feel that the pressure of the ribbon is actually pulling on that DSB because it's so soft. So I think maybe around the card stock would be better. I'm also going to do a little bit slightly different. Now you can do a bow like I've done here. Or you can just tie a slip knot, and I'm just going to do that this time because I really want to show you different variations of what you can do. So, this is one way, and this is another way. And you just tie that, so two knots on top of each other, and then just slip that, whoops, like that, and then cut that there and there. So if you find bows a little bit fiddly, this is a really good option to do instead of that. Okay, so just popping that onto there. So then you want to adhere that to your card. This is running out, I think. Right. So we just line that up, and put that down. Okay, so there we have that part. Now the second piece that we need is the little square that goes on top that we are going to mince. So this time I'm going to use pearls. I need to put another order in. We're just going to, this time, pop a pearl in the centre show you what a pearl. Now in your kits you will get the dimensionals to go on these flowers so you'll find them in your kits and 
we've just popped a couple of pearls on. So see the difference that you can make just with the two cards and um, very simple to put together. So thank you for joining me today. Subscribe below if you haven't subscribed to me. All the details you need to go to my store if you want to have a look at all of our, my products from Stamping Up. Just um, click on the link below or copy and paste. So thank you for joining me and I look forward to showing you the next card in the Mother's Day range for our kits for April. Thank you. Bye bye.